Hey guys, it's been a little bit since I've made a video, so I decided I need to do something. I made something last night and it tasted pretty bad. I had to just throw it outside in the woods, so I gotta do something easy here. I decided uh, while I was in the store, why is uh, good tasting juice drinks so pricey? I should just be able to make my own. So how about we make some lemon limeade? I looked it up, uh, the recipe is super easy. I thought I'd just show you via video so you can watch it. So uh, yeah, let's make that and uh, it's, you'll have plenty to drink. It'll be cheaper than most things, so let's get going. All right, so the ingredients should be pretty obvious. What I have here is three lemons and four limes. So uh, I feel like you get a little less juice out of limes. That's why I grabbed a little extra. These were cheap at Trader Joe's, so hopefully you can find some cheap ones nearby, but either way, it'll be a cheap drink overall. You're also gonna need some sugar, just some granulated sugar, so you can put it, mix it in the water. So that's all the ingredients. It is helpful to have this though. This is a thing to crush the lemons and limes. So if you see one of these, grab it. If you're gonna make enough of this juice, it'd be worth it to grab this. Otherwise, you may not wanna make this. Also, it's good to have a pitcher to put the lemonade in. Lemon lime aid. So there you have it. Let's get started. All right, now we gotta chop these bad boys up. Just cut them in half. All right, now the only hard work involved in this process. Just start juicing. All right, I finished juicing the lemons and limes and I will be honest, it will feel a little bit like an arm workout. This is what I got. When it started to fill up the pulp area, I poured it into this. So that way I could keep control of that. So this is all the juice I have here. And now we're gonna add it to a pitcher. And I left a slice of lemon and lime available to just add fanciness to this. Here we go. Now let's do the water. Now they say we're gonna put this on medium heat and stir it constantly. And dissolve. As you can see, just looks just like water now. But it's sugary, tasty water. All right, let's add it to the pitcher. And the nice thing about this is you can just keep adding water until you like the sugar content. You could always make more sugar water or next time use less and just keep adding water until it's more diluted. And now I'm just going to fill the rest of this pitcher with my filtered water here. I'm just going to fill it up. It doesn't really matter exactly how much water you're putting in it. I just want a lot of juice. There we go. Look at that. That looks really tasty. I need to drink some of that. All right, let's give it a taste. Oh man, it's incredible. I like the pulp in there too, but you could do it without pulp if you're really uh, careful with how you're juicing it and just make sure no pulp gets in there. Man, totally worth it. You just keep adding water to the uh, jug and you just keep adding it for a while. Ah, now that's cheap good juice. Thanks for watching. See you soon.